But I just always want to have like freaking gosh what is up you guys welcome back to my channel my name is a t you can call me t or sunny whichever one you like girl so we are in new york for fashion week and i'm staying at the moxie hotel but let me tell y'all how i busted my booty coming here <laughs> i busted my butt we was like well me i was uh coming across these little grates girl the greats took my luggage out and took me out with it. I said, oh my gosh, I had to look around like, did somebody see me? Girl, nobody was paying attention. Nobody was paying attention to me. Love that for me. But um, right now I'm staying in a double room, well a double queen, because Kayla's gonna be staying here tonight and then we're gonna get our own rooms tomorrow. But the view is actually kinda cute. Like, this is the view. Oh, this is the view. I'm like, it's kind of cute. We're on the fifth floor. Oh, what are they doing? Nothing, but I like his pants though. And okay, let me stop being nosy. Let me show y'all the room. Okay, firstly, that's the door, right? This is one bed, and then there's the other bed. The lights. I freaking love the lights like it just gives you a different type of vibe you know other than like a standard light they have a cute little telephone right here so freaking cute and then um, over here is the little desk area and I guess you flip this out or something like that they have some hangers here um and then over here is the door so you can shut this off well not the door but this is the bathroom so you can shut this off if you want you know some privacy of course but the bathroom itself i don't know how to turn it on i don't know oh this is a light girl how the lights turn on anyways but the vanity is super cute it's like it gives me like a vintage feel. And then toilet, yeah. Necessities. Okay, the shower is cute. It's no hair hanging from the dag on. Shower head, love that. Little area you can put your body wash and stuff. What they got? I ain't never heard of that brand, but no, I don't need nothing for my head. But yeah, cute little towel for the floor. Okay, y'all know I'm doing my inspection. When I show y'all room tours, <clears throat> I always do like a little inspection too. There must have been a little kid in here. Cause that's a small hand. That's like stuff like that. Y'all, it's like I love going places. But then every time I get to a room, I just be like, oh, what is that? Oh, tissue. I feel like it just always be something. I'm about to spray this room down with micro band and start doing a little bit of work before the festivities. Y'all, we is really in New York right now. I have never seen somebody do this. What? E.M. Rada. That is insane. Can y'all even see him down there? Cause same girl, cause same. Oh my God. Billy in New York, and yes, I'm like, my edges down right now, and like, but like, is that her? Because, like, she low key going off, like, she doing a lot, or is she the brand manager or something? Like, or is that her? I'm trying to see the booty because the girl got a little booty, so I'm like, hmm, girl, I'm in the city, I come alive in the nighttime. Oh, <laughs> oh, 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 it's Alexis over there. Oh, my god. I'm so happy to be back in New York, y'all. Like what? I'm about to start. Ugh, go crazy. Uh, go stupid. Uh. Go
go crazy. Ah, 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 ah. That was the quickest I've ever gotten ready. <laughs> that took me like, what was it? Four to five minutes. Baby, I'm dressed. I did a little bird bath. We ready. So we're about to go to some events right now. We're gonna take you guys. Well, I'm gonna take y'all along me. Kayla gonna take her her peoples along with her. But yeah, we're about to go. We, I think we're going to Aldo and then Target. And then whatever the night, you know, whatever we fall into. Your girl was going to a freaking Ooh, party. We going to a Target in that life. What right now? But let me show y'all my outfit real quick. Set y'all up on something. This is Z Fit. I got this top from Wolfer. Skirt is from, where's the skirt from? I'm gonna leave it on the screen. Um, jacket is like, it's called Teddy Fresh, but I just got it because the buttons are green and get a little beer right there. So cute. And then, oh, accessories. I can't tell you about that yet. I can't tell. I gotta keep it to myself just for a little bit. Um, and then, dunks. I think these are. Child, I forgot. But that's the fit. Okay. Jewelry, nothing really on me right now. And I got my regular JBW watch. But that's. I feel like, yeah, here by Camille, she did that for real. Did, did that. Okay, we about to go. Let's go. I just met my like teenage <laughs> crush, just you know, girl group, the, the best girl group ever, you know? This mother freaking, mother freaking Nelly. Don't talk to me because she noticed me. She was like, but like for real, for real, she did notice me. She was like, and smiled. And I was like, she knew. That's my homegirl now. Good morning, you guys. You said you have some? Which, what is it, the uh, Olaplex? Yeah. Oh, okay. Um, but yeah, good morning, you guys. I want to show you what I got last night. Firstly, this came in handy, but I didn't bring the charger for it. I do have the charger for this one I think. First things first, y'all know I had to get Koopy something. Hopefully, it looks so big, dang it. I didn't even realize that they that this was pinned up. I mean, he do have a bigger neck, but like. But I got him this, they have, it's coming out September 23rd. Look, it's so cute. It has like little rolling blazers logo right there. And it looks like he's in Harry Potter. That's it. That's the first thing I thought of. Is like Harry Potter. I got myself two like sweaters. One, I saw this and I was like Michigan Dunks, for sure. But in a medium because their sizes, uh, it's for unisex. So it depends on how you want it to look. Like if you want it to be more tighter, go down the size, of course. If you want it to be Oversized, get your size, don't go up. This shirt, these two shirts were 40 and then his thing was 32. I mean, not 32, 13. And it's so like $53 for three things. I feel like that's pretty good for Target. Yeah, and then we, like it was actually, <coughs> excuse me, Target was actually there. Like, we was really at Target. We'll target pop up y'all what i'm just so surprised that they had actually 
like Target receipts. Cause I put that on my, my mind, on my hood. We're walking, we're walking. <laughs> I just got to my room so I'm in a corner king now and now the sink is in the the, the room I'm gonna say in the bathroom the sink is in the room now but What's this? I mean, I know what this is, but like, oh my God, I'm about to break my nail. Okay, shower right here, right next to the bed. And then I'm assuming, yeah, this is the bathroom. Okay. Hey, I found the lights there. Oh, wait. Okay, the master It's that one that turns on all the lights and stuff. I don't know why my shoes are sticky. But so far, everything is going good though. Oh, and the bed was super comfortable. We was knocked out. But the view is way better from this room. Way better. That little smear mark. Like, what the freak? <laughs> and the Tesla got good lighting. Okay, right. Look at the. Mm. What at? Look at this. What at? Eaten. <laughs> yeah. With the fashion Who? show ready. Miss Alexis motherfucking Rebecca. Fashion show ah! ready. We're ready, y'all. Excited. You wanna say where your fit is from? Girl Fashion Nova. Okay. No, but <laughs> is it really? It's a backup, yeah. It looks good. Thank you. She smells good, y'all. Oh Thank my gosh. You. <laughs> <laughs> um, I think mine's is everything Zara. This is a little the way It's so cute. Yeah. Thank you. Period. And then yeah, my shoes are Zara too. Period. Zara just. Oh, wait, I wait. I have these sling backs. Yeah, yes. I got the same ones. Yeah. I'm like Zara gets you out the way every time. <laughs> No, the sushi because we couldn't find it, so we're sticking with pizza. <laughs> another club, another club, plain, next place. Y'all have been on this whole time, but my management team sent something. So I'm gonna see what this is. Ooh, orb. Ooh, I've heard about orb. How do I open? Ooh. Oh, oh, that's probably gonna be nice. It's probably like a shimmer oil or something. Blowout, moisturizing cream, nice. That looks very luxe. And then we got a cute little bag. This is my management day house. Let's see. Oh. <gasps> What the freak? Are you kidding me? We definitely need the band-aids. Y'all, I have been wanting a like camera like this. What is it like a um I can't think right now. I love. I love and now we have pajamas too. And it's from my favorite brand, Stars of Freaking Bub. Yes, if y'all don't have anything from Stars Above, you need something immediately. I want to put this on right now. But I'm trying to wait because it might be something going on tonight. But 
it might be giving stay in the um, I don't know I'm gonna hydrate and we'll see we'll see girls the show was really nice the pieces that the way they styled them so beautiful I actually very happy that I wore this outfit instead of the turtleneck that they sent me it's cute but I would have just been really really hot and you know it just would have been out of place because there was nobody in turtlenecks but yeah i'm about to take this off and get a little comfortable a few moments later <laughs> Cooper now. Right, that's what I just said. I miss Cooper. Look, he looked like this is exactly how Cooper be. Good morning, you guys. So I'm about to actually start getting ready. I have a lunch to go to, like a luncheon. It's gonna be like a panel discussion with uh, other black beauty creators and um, people in the industry and stuff like that. So I have to get ready for that because it starts at 12 and lunch starts getting served at 12.45. So I don't wanna be late. I don't wanna be that black girl, you know what I mean? But I'm definitely trying to stay hydrated because I noticed that yesterday I did not drink a lot of water at all. I'm also not a hookah girly. I've learned that. This is my like fourth time or fifth time trying it. I had to clear some memory space. Some memory space? I had to clear some space on my memory card. But um, yeah, I'm just not a hookah girly. It made my head hurt a little bit. And I didn't like inhale it like, you know, you puffing it i didn't even do that and it still made my hair hurt my head hurt so hookah's is just not for me not for me and neither is dairy can't do it and i have to figure out how i'm gonna survive because literally everything i eat has dairy in it but let's get ready because i want to take my time getting ready today okay, so all right you guys i am dressed and I didn't even tell y'all that I'm going to a black beauty brunch. Did I tell y'all that? What? I got invited to a black beauty brunch. Lunch. Brunch. So yeah. I, um, what's it called? I'm getting distracted by like how good I look. I'm sorry y'all. <sighs> so I used to do like makeup real heavy like back in the day like doing reviews showing like new makeup um products and stuff and i'm going to a black beauty lunch like where other black creators black celebrities are going to be there um i believe it's going to be a panel so i will be recording a little bit but jewelry oh i need to put some more lotion on jewelry i got this from bag it up this is from amazon this one right here and then this one is from Bag It Up as well. I wish like I had a nice little gold something, you know? But I don't really have any gold necklaces. I need to go back to that place. I don't think they really had any gold necklaces either though. So, never mind. But and then my dress, let me show y'all. The dress is by Jordan Woods. Super, super cute. The platform shoes that I showed y'all, I'm just wearing these. And then I'm wearing my Jock Moose bag. What's up this? So that's what I'm wearing. And clearly y'all can't fit in there. Um, But I'm excited. I feel like it's a very full circle moment for me. And I love that. So I'm just excited to be doing new things and pushing myself out of my comfort zone like that's just my main thing 
this year and every year to come. I wanna keep pushing myself out my comfort zone to see how far I can stretch. We're gonna honor and we're gonna make sure that everyone feels seen, heard, and appreciated. So from the bottom of my heart, thank you all for being here. Let's have some fun and uh, BBR is it. Thank you. Here's the story. When people say, when Malcolm X, and you go to anybody's house and they're radical, you see a picture of Malcolm X, right? You see him standing by the window with a rifle or shotgun, you know. And they think that's what he meant when he said by any means necessary. That's where the conversation kind of leads to where we're at right now because even at that point, I had a lot of black models in my book. We didn't have Instagram, so we had to have actual portfolios that went out to clients in order for you to get work. And for me living in Miami, in order for me to work, I couldn't have black models in my book, right? So it couldn't be known that I was a black person that did makeup because it was automatically known that, okay, you're black, it means you only do black people. For so many years to accept this award, the AJ Crane. So you've never allowed your dream to diminish or actually dim and I thank you for that we thank you for that and with that said guys there is a legacy award guys Woo! stand up please stand up for my sister stand up for my sister and to my list please Woo -woo! to use his brain they only allowed him to use his hands you know he was never allowed to go to school because they didn't think he was worthy He didn't learn to read until he was in his 50s, learning from his children. But in spite of all of that, he raised 14 children. We live in a house because he didn't want us to have to live in an apartment. He didn't want us to have a lab. Okay. I'm back in the room, I'm only here for a second because we're going to a Essence um, event. Y'all, this foundation, I'm about to touch up my um my makeup a little bit, but it's not even a foundation. Well, is it? Wearing tent stick. Y'all know what I'm talking about. This is fire. Okay, I can actually turn this. The lights off. Because... It's enough light up in here. I'm from this with a limo. Did y'all understand what I just said? Or no? Um, but that event was so nice. They gave us a huge, huge bag of I don't know what. But I did see some lashes and I did see something from Yes. Miss Mother Freaking Danessa Myrick. And I think this is This shade, like, are you kidding me? This is literally the perfect peachy color. I did get something shipped here because I don't have a lot of like chunky necklaces. Necklaces in general, I do not have. Uh, it's from Hernan Preston, black designer. Nice, right, it's all wrapped up. It's so pretty. This would have been perfect for today. All right, from Revolve, so we have time to, you know, we want it, we don't want it, whatever. So I feel like this one is a cute statement piece, you know, with a little pearl. I've really been into things with pearls. It's Use the room. It was chaos. I just changed my outfit. Okay, so I'm wearing this Calvin Klein um, shirt dress. This uh, corset is from Zara. Shoes are from, you can't see them, but they're Zara. Um, accessories, Kendra Scott. I have to go back to them because one of the little diamonds came out. Okay, we got to Okay, JBW watch, accessories, normal Amazon, the new necklace. The wig glasses and my pink bag. 
and we're out. So Y'all, like, a cold? <laughs> It's not funny, I'm sorry. It's really not funny. I am traumatized. A bug literally fell right here on me. And it looked insane. Like, I thought it was this part of my necklace. No. And let's save the day she killed it. I'm surprised you wasn't like, yeah, you can get this bug. It was huge and I literally picked it. That got us out the way. Wait, you're not recording. Oh. <laughs> no. Okay. You gotta get the red. Mine was too. I had to delete some okay. stuff. Girl, look at the camera. All the all the cameras. Okay, all the vloggers are out. I love it. I love it. All these beautiful women. That is what I love. Be on disability, but gave me this ability, and now she walking with her head. Hi, my name is Crystal, and this is me after drink wine. Select this. Yeah, and this is me after drink. I think it's like five of this one. For the night? For the yeah, night? For the night. 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 Okay, this is Atia. This is drink three. This is Scarlett, and this is also drink three. <laughs> no meals, just liquor. Yeah, go ahead and split that with me. Go ahead and split that. Yeah, I'm gonna split it with you. Okay. If y'all just wanna make everything equal, you know, we can do that. You good? Yeah. Okay. Uh, you a long <laughs> Okay, you guys, this is my third shot in, and this is me. Hi, my name is Alexis, and this is my sixth drink, and I'm feeling good. Hey, girl. My name is Crystal, and this is me. Where's to my cup just now? Yeah. yeah. <laughs> this is me after my third shot, sixth drink of the night. Here's wow. your second drink. I don't know. Hi guys, this is my third shot and I'm fine. I can eat two more. Wow. Good morning, you guys. I'm on my way to meet up with my friends so we can have like a lunch um, because he's here in the city. Um, and last night, wow, okay. Estee Lauder had an after party. It was just very basic. It didn't give me Estee Lauder vibes, you know? Come on, because this is copyright, girl. You don't want the copyright. We were all about money. Okay, so yeah, like I was saying, um, I lost my ID and we went to this Estee Lauder after party and it was cute, but it was just like standing room. I thought it was gonna be like more elevated, but they partnered with this kind of streetwear brand. I said, girl, I could have wore some streetwear instead of wearing a dress. So guess who's gonna put that dress back on? Yeah. Went to the Essence event. I saw Kia, Notorious Kia. Love her. She is so funny. Um, and so pretty in person. She was doing her thing. She was styling up there, doing her big one. So proud of her. Why is he grooving? He is in his own world. <laughs> I say you are in your own world. I called your name and everything. Oh, okay, 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 okay. Who is this? Oh, no, no, no. I'm you listening to, to Oh My Moon. Oh My Moon. I This one's for you. Baby, you my head bang. You all I ever wanted. We could do it real big. I look like Angie Mama. Literally. And I'm just taking everything in well let's just say this where my head is at right now what i'm thinking about and stuff thinking about like why i never really want to go to fashion week and i think it's primarily due to i've always been 
a thicker girl. Like, I always had boobs. I always had a little, a little butt. I don't have a little butt. I have a butt, okay? I've always had these things, and I never really wanted to go to Fashion Week or just show my style because... The norm that I saw since I was a little girl was literally girls that had A cups, girls that had no stomach, girls that had no booty. Never wanted that though. But I just always wanted to have like a petite frame and I never had that. And I think, <clears throat> granted I love that Kia styled a girl, you know, she had that opportunity to style someone. I would love to see that but just on a curvier girl. I would love to see curvy girls in fashion shows, not plus size fashion shows, but just a regular fashion show. Somebody that has a regular body, literally. Not a body that is um, flat, abs. Like the Legance thing, it, it made me feel just like damn I've been like contemplating like speaking openly about being a mid-sized girly because I'm not plus size but being in the middle and how girls if you don't have like curvaceous a curvaceous body where you look like hourglass and you're plus size you get overlooked like for me sometimes I feel like I look I get overlooked on like Instagram and stuff and like TikTok sometimes if it's not hair content because of the way my boobs look and I hate feeling that way but it just is what it is like if you don't got a BBL especially black girls if you don't got a BBL if you don't have a hourglass body you tend to get overlooked and that's basically why I never wanted to come to Fashion Week. I'm here and I just feel, I feel good about it, but I also feel a little triggered. <sighs> yeah. And then I even see black fashion shows, like they'll have girls that are more curvaceous and have regular body types, but for like the high-end fashion shows. Don't know by that I mean. And then it's literally like if I wore something that a skinnier girl wore, it gets like, ew, why are you wearing that? But yet if a skinny girl is literally standing right beside me and she wore it, it's giving fashion, it's giving classy. I've always been afraid to speak about, speak up about how mid-size, plus-size girlies get overlooked. Girls that don't look like the typical fashion model get overlooked um or they're put in a category of plus size fashion or something like that plus size fashion runway or something like that instead of like just being on the runway i it's like every time i see a girl that looks like me on like a victoria's secret model or something i'm like yes but it just always feels like it's more that needs to be done for fashion in general. Today is the end of fashion week for me at least. And I cannot be more excited. Honestly, I miss Cooper. I miss my man. I miss being at home. I'm still upset that I lost my driver's license and I have to literally go to a kiosk to get it. Like, <clears throat> I'm ready to go home. I think the last, the, I have a brunch today. I have, um, what else do I have today? I'm gonna tell you, I am tired. 
I am tired. My voice is like gone because talking and it be a lot of people. So you're yelling, literally yelling at people. And then it's like people are here. I don't know if y'all saw some of your favorite influencers. I saw some of mine. And you know my friends are here too and we're not really at the same shows and when we are it's like so many other people too so like, i really couldn't talk talk to jay i really couldn't talk talk to a lot of people you know you do code this but you know you do code this and this it's so nice and so pigmented you don't believe i just got dressed y'all well we put that ish on real quick i have to put on my perfume i just forgot about that but i am loving this necklace like are you kidding me it's so cute um so yeah i'm wearing let me show y'all real quick i already showed tiktok so let me show my youtube girlies so i have on this amazon top y'all know these are the amazon Bottega dupes um the necklace i got from revolve trousers are from asos it's cute in the back. I like the little pocket detail right there. That's cute. Um, and then Loewe Puzzle Bag. JBW Watch. I got this one from the Vintage Market. Amazon Rings. And oh, my shoes. The shoes are Travis Scott. I love something. Yeah. They're like retro, OG, something like that. But girl, I am so Delulu right now. I sound very raspy. <sighs> like I drunk water and everything, brushed the teeth, everything is still is still giving raspy. That means I've been yelling at people. It's okay. I gotta pack up this bag though because I kind of want to change. Even if I don't change, I do want to bring my um tripod, which is like if you're like me and you are more minimal with your outfits and stuff. And you just want to give like a little oomph. This. This, this, this. Like I know everybody's like in the teardrop Bottega. But like you can see it from the front. And I feel like that's what people want. Like some earrings you want to see from the front. Some earrings you just like you don't want to keep it a stud. But this is good. And if you have sensitive skin. It won't break you out. Yeah. station and I need it like I only had a little sips sips of water and I'm I'm feeling dehydrated but the show was really really cute it gave me like the street wear vibe I already saw a dress that I want to get from them I'm gonna see if they got it in my size but yeah I rate that show my first show I rate it like an 8 out of 10 what you rate it, Lex? Um, I give it a seven. Seven? Yeah. Scarlet? I would say seven as well. Yeah. Okay. Yeah, it was given it. Seven? <laughs> okay. Yeah. <laughs> I'm about to say. What's your wellness affirmation? Yeah, mine is always be kind to yourself. Oh, yes. I love it. Thank you. Shiny. 
some churro, beignet type of dessert. But yeah, I'm about to do the shots first though. Cheers, ladies. Oh, good night. Cheers. Cheers. All right, y'all. So we're finished now. We just paid. The bill came to like 264 if you're curious. Well, uh, it was three of us here, so yeah, it is a little expensive, but it's called Ixta. It was really, really good. Um, I would give it like an 8.5 out of 10. Um, for ambiance, like look at the little, it's so cute. The chip be a little bit of salt, but after the salt was added, it was good. The salsa was great. Queso pandita was good. And I don't even like mushrooms. They put mushrooms in it. It was good. The only Ooh. cause was Uber X. Or comfort. Uber comfort. Yep. Comfort or like, black. I was like, girl, just call us a regular one. And now I see why. Because why would this. I Are we in a rose or what? <laughs> you. <laughs> you would never know. You would okay. never know. You would never know. Maybe double horse. <laughs> Period. Okay. <laughs> so, um, we met this girl at the Core Hydration House. And she let us in. We have standing early. seats. We have standing seats. She said, yeah, you guys. She was like waving us down. So, see, like, this just means you have to be good to people wherever you go because you never know who you're going to run into again. Even yeah. still, just be good to people. Earlier, because we didn't think we were going to see her again. We're like, no, because she, yeah, she was trying to get us into, like, some other stuff that she yeah. was a part of. Okay, we're gone. Okay, bye. <laughs> We was talking about Ubers because you know the nice Uber before, so I'm like, yeah, I only get comfort. <laughs> <I'm> really crying. <laughs> I'm so deep. Okay, I'm sorry. I'm really crying, like yo. Okay, so I said I only get comfort or black, <laughs> and let's. <laughs> I said, is this a comfort? She said, mm -mm. no. Mm -mm. I was being treated. <laughs> and she gonna whisper, this smells like a part. <laughs> and in the other one, it smells like pee. It was so not. Wait, which one? <laughs> the one that I called to the hotel? Yes. And his seat stopped his seat. I was like, oh. The seats. Oh, I'm this really crying. crying. All right, this will be the last time. Yeah. This will be Ooh. the last time. Ooh, I'm really crying. <laughs> and it'd be like giving all the ones that just be the regular, it'd be so mm. Yeah, yeah, you're right. <coughs> it's like a different level. Oh, the seats were horrible in that one. Yeah. Ooh, Jesus. All and right. then so let them know. I've learned I've learned my Please. lesson. I'm not gonna be cheap no more. I'm gonna call the X. I think Tia calls the comfort X. Yeah, comfort. She calls the good ones. Mm -hmm. Okay. Comfort or black. Come on, he's me. It's like a little toot toot. Duh. Girl. 
so the hotel has like these uh little stash closets right so firstly i called down there to get a pad because i came with my period early freaking syncing up with the rest of the girls and um i knew my period was going to my period usually comes on time every time so i just knew you know what i'm saying i was gonna come on after new year fashion week so i called down there an hour ago nobody came up and it's like even the time that i called for an iron i was already dressed by the time they came like it took them an hour to come that time too so i finally went down in a freaking goose hunt chase whatever you call it to get these pads in the stash closet she said it was in floor six and she was oh that's kind of far away from your floor girl that was five minutes versus an hour and i got me a deodorant thanks morning y'all so i'm about to go through the gift bag that black beauty roster gave us okay we already got the Dessa, Dessa myrick but we got another Dessa myrick product this is the blurring balm powder for face and eyes in universal so i'm guessing this is like a face powder can't too i think this is a styler Ooh, this is cute. This is from T3. It's like a little kit of different brushes and combs that you can use for your edges or your hair. That's cute. Uh, this is uh, lashes from Lashify. A huge thing from Lashify. I feel like this is like a, some type of kit. Yeah, this is some type of kit. Because I have to break all this down. I can't bring it with me. All right. Oh. So if you want to do like your own lashes at home, this is a kit for it. Oh, we got a little book, another comb. Oh, this is a hair strengthening, um, I want to say a mask from Orbe. I heard this is a really good brand. Eye mask from Ulta. Oh, this is from the Gabrielle Union collection as well as this product. This is co-wash and then this is a curl refresher oh a face roller this is a stainless steel face roller i've never used a stainless steel one another eye mask more lashes this is some more stuff for your lashes i want to this probably looks like to get it off oh this is pre-cleanse and yeah it's melted away take it off braiding and twisting gel from cantu this looks like some type of palette yeah this is a Nessa Myrick probably like a little eyeshadow palette or something um sunscreen from black girl sunscreen um some mascara from Tarte more lashes from Lashify okay they really I love that um a brush I actually need a new eyebrow brush this is the eyebrow brush so it has like a spoolie on the end and then the brushes on the other side um, oh yes, I've been wanting to try Mizani out for a minute now. So this is the Mizani hair dress. I'm uh, what is this? We'll figure it out. And we have a little lip plump, which I don't need. And then a card from them. It says, thank you for joining us today. We hope you enjoy your BBR bag of gifts. Keep being beautiful and we will see you next time. Yes, y'all will. Period. So I'm gonna leave this here. And then just leave like, you know, the stuff that I am not taking with me. I'm gonna put some stuff in here too that might help. But overall, this trip has been a good one, I will say. It has been a goodie, very memorable. I met so many creators, I met so many people. Um, I am literally full. My social battery is gone. 
I want to go home. But I'm so thankful. Oh, y'all can't even see me. Sorry, 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 sorry. Um, but yeah, I'm so thankful to be here and to be surrounded by so many black women, women, style, like just everything. It's been very inspiring to say the least. And I love it. I just love being around creative people. Oh my freaking God, I'm watching all of Destiny right now. But y'all, I am so happy. I could cry right now. I could really cry right now because I just found my ID. My freaking driver's license, not even my ID. My driver's license. It's just be the way things happen. I'm literally like zipping it up my suitcase. Saw this on the side, my little, a little sock. I don't know what the other sock pair is. Then, literally, I look this way, like under here. I'm like, hold on, another sock might be under there. The ID was laying right there. That's amazing. That is like freaking amazing. Because God love me. He love me. Something like this. We also have this chunky piece. Let's we also have this I'm about to go to the train station. So I'm gonna close out today's vlog. I hope you guys enjoyed it. And um, just enjoyed my first fashion week with me. Uh, I definitely enjoyed it. It met my expectations, you know. I understand now what the girlies mean by it's a lot because it's a lot. But it was good. It was good for my first fashion week. I feel like the next time I come, it will be better and it'll be better and better and better and better. You know? So I'm excited for it. Uh, definitely subscribe, like, comment, share with your girlies, with your home girl, with your men. And also follow me on Instagram and TikTok. I would love to have you a part of that little community over there. It's not little because we're growing every day. So let's not call it little to you okay um but yeah i love you guys so much and i will see you in my next video or in my next vlog bye girl